Alright, g'day guys. Tonight I'm going to be looking again at Realmworks, uh, this time playing around with some new functionality uh, that's going to come out in the, the next patch, uh, and that functionality is how to copy a realm. So this is functionality that the beta team has been playing around with for a while, um, and basically there's going to be a couple of different ways to sort of create copies and exports of your realm. Uh, the main focus is going to be for this video is just how to copy, uh, and then later videos I'll focus on how to do an export and an import. Alright, so let's jump over and have a look. Alright, so in front of me you can see the Realmworks uh, launcher screen. Uh, this is obviously what comes up when you log into Realmworks each time. Uh, and then if you go over to your Realms tab, you'll see a list of all the different Realms that you've got available to play with. So these are Realms that you've created. Um, some of you might have one, some of you might have 20, depending on how you uh, use the tool. Um, today I'm going to play with the Primeval Thul um, Realm. And let's just open that and I'll just give you a brief glance over what's actually in here so you get an idea of what it is that I'm trying to achieve. Uh, this is a very simple, this is a, this is fresh. I've put two pictures in. That's it. These two pictures here. All right. Uh, we'll save it so that one's one's actually got a, uh, a player visible just to see what happens there. We'll go switch realms. All right. So all the copying is actually done from the launcher itself. I'm just going to sync that little change that was uh, to make an article player visible. Shouldn't take too long. There we go. Just wait for it to refresh. Australian internet is not the quickest thing around. All right, and here we go. So to copy a realm, it's it's really simple. All right, you select your realm, you click the toolbar icon, and you go copy realm. Uh, enter a name. So I'm just going to leave it as it is. And then the game system that is basically uh, selected with the realm is is copied over. So we're going to create realm copy. Now the reason I'm showing you a, basically a fresh new uh, realm is to show you that you know the functionality, while it's actually quite efficient, if you're doing a bigger realm, it's going to take a lot longer time. All right, so the amount of time, pretty much any of the exporting or copying functionality takes, is going to be dependent on the size of the realm. Um, my primary realm, um, it's it's basically something I, I start and I walk away and get a coffee. All right, so now we've got a copy. Uh, I've got Premier Fill. We've got the copy. And if we double click on that and load into it, we should see two pictures. Alright, then as you can see, it's a direct copy, so it's actually come over. Alright, so let's just have a quick discussion about why copy would be useful. Um, copy is literally as it sounds, it is a copy. Uh, it's not going to create the links um, to imported content the way that people probably want to be able to achieve um, and by that I mean like if you're using the the export and the import functionality uh, you can actually export something and import into another realm um, and then go back and make changes to that content again and make another export and import it again and the, the links will all carry over so that, that's going to be very advanced functionality this here is a lot simpler this is for those of you who maybe have a, a realm already in place for a campaign setting uh, and you just need a new copy of that to get up and started that's what the copy functionality is for um, perhaps you're running two different groups through the same story module you could create a copy and basically um, get the other party up and running on their complete separate instance of, uh, of Realmworks so um, that 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 is all there is to copy guys it's really quite simple um, it's all done from the launcher screen just click that little toolbar icon uh, and click copy and complete the wizard that's all there is so um, hope that's uh, useful for you too uh, if you've got any questions if there's any videos you'd like to see uh, please post in the comments below uh, and apart from that i'll see you guys online thank you